Thank you all for joining us today as we remember the life and accomplishments of our dear spacecraft friend, Cassini. Three, two, one, and liftoff of the Cassini spacecraft on a billion mile trek to Saturn. So we were trying to come up with an epitaph to inscribe on Cassini's headstone. It was impossible to pick just one. To start with, you could say, first to orbit Saturn. Even though other spacecraft had performed flybys before Cassini got to Saturn in 2004, Cassini was the first to go into orbit and stay there. And the Cassini spacecraft is on its way to Saturn. T plus 20 seconds, all systems are go. Or how about always stuck the landing? In 2005, the Huygens lander sat down on Titan, one of Saturn's moons. It was the first landing on a moon other than our own and the first landing in the outer solar system. You could say danced on Saturn's rings. Cassini figured out how Saturn's rings formed, what they're made of, and how they relate to Saturn's moons. During the grand finale, Cassini performed a series of 22 orbits, diving between Saturn and its rings and discovering even more fascinating details. Or there's my favorite, Explorer of the Ocean Moons. Cassini helped us understand Titan, a moon of Saturn that has an atmosphere and lakes of liquid methane on its surface. It also discovered geysers streaming off the surface of Saturn's moon Enceladus, and the underground ocean that exists beneath Enceladus's icy surface. Both of these moons of Saturn are considered some of the best targets in our solar system to look for potential alien life. Or you could say, solve the mystery of the bright dark surface on the moon Iapetus, revealed seven previously unknown moons, discovered Saturn's polar hurricanes, observed a once in 30 years planet-wide storm on Saturn, tested general relativity by measuring radio waves distorted by the sun, detected Saturn's ring spokes, these mysterious features that appear and disappear with the seasons, witnessed seasonal rainstorms on Titan, revealed the relationships between Saturn's moons and its rings, got closer to determining the length of a Saturn day, and spotted Saturn's aurora. One thing is for certain, Cassini is a victim of its own success. Because it discovered these potentially habitable moons, Titan and Enceladus, those worlds had to be protected. That's why it was sentenced to die by smashing into Saturn. Rest in peace, Cassini.